the genuine yawn that I want to express something real quick. Many a times I've been on the way to the gym or I've been at the, at the house sleepy, yawning, got in the truck, driving to the gym, yawning, get in the gym, yawning. That's so easy in those stages to say, oh, you know, I'm, I'm tired, I'm sleepy, I, I'm just going to take a nap or, nah, I don't think I need to work out that I'm a little sleepy. I come every time. And what happens? As soon as you get in the gym, as soon as you start moving, you wake up like that. Great session. Wow, glad I went to the gym. The other alternative, like I said, oh, you sit home, nah, I'm too sleepy, uh, that might take a little nap. You wake up from that nap, you sit home, watch TV. Damn, that hour, hour and a half, two hours, however long you're in the gym passes. Damn. Didn't even get anything from that day. Didn't improve physically, didn't improve mentally from coming to the gym. Because that's a mental gain by pushing past that temporary sleepiness, that tired, sleepy state. Pushing past that, to, you know, go and actually towards your goal and work on your goal. It's a mental gain. Then you can actually get the mental benefits of coming to the gym exercising too. And uh, this adds up every day like that. All those little, little moments like that adds up to the person you want to be. Adds up to, you know, in five years, in 10 years, in 15 years, adds up to either you arriving where you want to arrive in the next five, 10, 15 years, or either adds up to you arriving or becoming the person you didn't want to be in the next five, 10, 15 years. It starts today in the small habits.